Hi everyone, it's Larry from Nostos product team. In this short tutorial video, I'll show you the steps how you can include Nostos email personalization widget to your newsletters or other emails when you're using MailChimp as your email engine. Before getting started with the tutorial and showing you how things work, a brief intro what you can do with the feature. Widgets allow you to promote the right products to the right audience by personalizing product recommendations in your email marketing so that each of your customers will be shown products that they're more likely to click and buy. All this easily without any integrations. Now, let's have a look how widgets work with MailChimp. What you need to do first is to navigate here on the uh, Nosto admin panel under emails and email widgets which will show you something like here. And these are the uh, email widget types that we have to offer. The first one here on the top is the bestseller product widget, basically promoting the trending products that are currently hot on your store. And the three other types that we have here are the uh, actual personalized email widgets. The first one is actually called personalized, personalized recommendations, since it gives more weight to items that your users or customers who have visited your store have shown interest in. And the second type browsing history, as it basically states out, is the linear browsing history, simply displaying or showcasing the products in that order that a user has browsed them during the past or the recent visit to the store. And the third one is really interesting one. It's the browsing history related uh, email widget. It's a little bit different from these two, since it displays or showcases products that a, a user hasn't viewed yet, but something that is related to their past browsing and shopping behavior on the site. And what is really cool about all these three email types is that if Nosto is unable to identify the user or recipient of your newsletter, these three types always fall back to the bestseller product widget so that the widget in, in the email that you'll be sending out never stays empty so that we always show at least something that is personalized or otherwise fresh on your store. Let's start the uh, widget or creation funnel by creating browsing history related widget, which lands us here. Uh, first step is to select the email service provider. Since we're creating the widget for MailChimp, we don't pretty much need to do anything, but we do support other email service providers as well. Clicking next here, which lands us the uh, visual settings where I assume you will be sending a little bit more time. What we can do here is edit or customize a little bit of the uh, visual appearance of the email widget, such as some key aspects like product price font color. Let's change that to something that looks good to me and something else like product name font size some key visual settings for the uh, widget the title here probably you want to change it to something else like here and once you have made some changes or amendments to the design you can easily preview how the changes have been applied in the widget so this is how the widget will now appear if we will use it as is in, in newsletters. It'll display me here, the trending products on the store. Now jumping back to the uh, wizard. So once everything is set up here, once you're satisfied with, with the design, let's click next, landing us on overview step in the wizard. So the name for the campaign is just something that you'll see uh, here on the Nosto admin when you're tracking the performance of different email widgets in the analytics. And the two things that you can do here or what actually you need to do is either to download the snippet code that will be populated and added to your MailChimp uh, template editor. You, you can download it as an HTML or simply just copy it to clipboard either by clicking the copy to clipboard or simply copying it, copying it from here from the uh, text area. And once everything looks good to you, simply click save and you can move to MailChimp's own template editor. 
Okay, and when you're in your MailChimp template editor, you have your basic email design here in the preview mode. And adding the Nostal personalization widget couldn't be easier. You simply need to uh, drag and drop a custom HTML block or module by MailChimp to a position where you want to use Nostal's widget. And then the email code snippet that you just exported from the Nosto admin, you just paste it here and it'll display the personalization widget in the preview mode. And if you want to go beyond, if you're not satisfied with the uh, emails, email widgets design here, you can just simply edit, the, edit and adjust the code in the uh, email template editor here, or then you can go back to the Nosto admin where you can still customize the font color, the font size, and settings in the Vmail widget itself. So that's all this time. If you have any further questions, please visit our support pages on support.nosto.com or email us support at nosto.com. Thanks.